Hi, I'm Tom Burke, and I'm going to use this session to uh, show you a few of the basic design tools in IOLINE Design. These are useful not only for the Crystal Press Rhinestone setting system, but they can be used for the uh, Applique 300 or our 100 system vinyl cutter. We're going to do a simple t-shirt design. We'll start by creating the lettering. show you kind of a handy tool that we have. It's called the on-screen kerning tool. By clicking on this it provides you with a handle that allows you to expand the lettering and spread it out a little bit so that uh, it's a little easier to read or it can change the nature of the design. I'm going to take that down a little in size. and we're going to apply that to an arc by simply checking on fit text to arc and notice here that we can then change the angle or the curvature of the arc simply by pulling on these handles like so. When we're happy with the placement we have we'll simply click on select and now we have our curved image going to put that right on this guideline here. And now we're going to add some more lettering. Again, we'll spread the kerning out just a little bit, and we'll take the letter size down a bit, and we're going to take this and also fit it to an arc, but we're going to fit this to the bottom of the arc. Let's move out here so you can see a little better what we're doing. grabbing this handle in the center, we'll bring the lettering around to the bottom of the arc. Then simply clicking on invert flips it over for us. We'll click on select and we'll bring that lettering up onto our design area. Again, we'll move it over a little so that it's on the same center line with the word we previ previously created. Now, we're going to add a star. Simply by selecting from our Shapes tool and drawing a star the appropriate size. select that and using this handle change the angle of it and using the arrow keys we'll just move it over until it's on the same center line that we used previously. Now we're going to add an outline around that star by simply clicking on the outline tool selecting a different color and going over here to the outline dimension and increasing it until we get what looks like a good amount of offset. We'll close that and now we'll select the entire design. Click on export to IOLINE, crystal press, and we'll call it All Star. Crystal Studio program. Click on open.
open file and we'll open the all star file we just created. Now it's a very simple matter to select the stone sizes we want to use. I'm going to use 6 SS stones for the red layer and for the yellow layer I'm going to use 16s. Just that quickly we have a design personalized to a particular school and ready to use. Hope this tells you a little bit more about the tools that are available in IO-Line Design. Thanks very much.